Hi, welcome to this video on the feasibility of used wind turbines. Keep watching this video till the end to find out if you can save yourself tens of thousands of dollars. On this channel, Synergy Files, we aim to inspire budding engineers and technicians for a better, more sustainable world. Please do subscribe to our channel to stay posted. So without further ado, let's address the question, what are used or refurbished wind turbines and are they worth it? Well, refurbished wind turbines are used wind turbines in which fail or worn components are replaced to a point that the wind turbine is operational again. As the wind turbine technology matures in Europe and elsewhere, many wind turbines are getting replaced with newer models. Similarly, there are many areas where lease for the wind farm has expired or many a times changes in the infrastructure can become a hindrance to functioning of existing wind turbines. In such cases, scores of wind turbines have to be decommissioned from a site. Fortunately, there are now established businesses that acquire these turbines, refurbish them, and sell them on for a fraction of their original price. One can also purchase used wind turbines directly from the manufacturers like Vestas, Nordex, Enercon, etc. In many cases, the turbines can be acquired for less than half the price of a new one. Given that wind turbines can make up to 60% of the overall cost of installation and commissioning, then with good wind resource, break-even time of 4-5 to five years can be expected as opposed to 7-8 to eight years. So yes, it is definitely worth investing in second-hand wind turbines, provided there is good quality wind resource at your selected site. When purchasing a used wind turbine, there are however a few factors that must be considered. Just like when you shop for a used car, you look at the service history. Similarly, wind turbines also have their service books and the service history must also be given due diligence. Likewise, it must be noted that there are different classes of wind turbines based on the site's wind resource, mainly wind speed and turbulence levels. One must therefore ensure that not just any turbine but the right class of turbine is purchased for their own site. Now wind turbines generally have a life of 20 years. The gearbox is replaced or refurbished two to three times in its 20 year lifetime. Experts have observed that in most cases the gearbox is replaced every eight to nine years. This entirely depends upon whether the winds at the location are turbulent or steady. In some cases, the wind turbine gearboxes need to be replaced in less than five years. On the other hand, the most a gearbox can last is about 10 years. There are systems in place that can measure the health of a gearbox. They're able to evaluate the wear and tear condition based on the metal content in the oil used for lubricating the gearbox. Similarly, there are other methods by which the gearbox integrity can be gauged. So when buying a used wind turbine, make sure that the gearbox has been replaced recently. The second thing to be considered is the blade wear. The leading edge of the wind turbine blade is more susceptible to the wear and tear and the reason is that the speed of the wind the turbine cuts through linearly increases as one moves away from the hub to the tip of the blade. Relative wind speeds are the highest at the tip. Any wind turbine located in a terrain that has abundance of dust, bugs, rain, sleet, snow or any other abrasive air particulate is more susceptible to erosion than a turbine located in an area where these factors are not present. So it should be ensured that the blade wear is minimal. You can get the turbine inspected privately just to make sure that there are no major issues that may cost you in the future. The price of a second-hand wind turbine will depend upon a lot of factors. These include the age, power rating, the badge name, and the condition it has been exposed to, etc. Generally, the bigger the size of the wind turbine, the more the percentage of discount. Here is a sample of the price. A Vestas V29 with a capacity of 250 kilowatts can be purchased for merely $49,000. For comparisons, at this price, a new turbine with only 10 to 15 kilowatt capacity can be purchased. Many of the used wind turbines may be able to harness the same amount of energy as their new counterparts. So once again, it is an investment worth making if you have a site that is suitable. For more information on what to consider while installing a wind turbine, there is a video that has already been made. The link for that is in the description. 
And with this, the video on the feasibility of used wind turbines is concluded. If you learned from it, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for the latest videos, and thank you for your kind attention.